Marit Sukhavit, uh, executive suite, which we kept waiting for four hours, but at least they gave us another room in the interim. And what you get for one of these is a very nice sitting room. Good ceiling detail. There's a bit of, uh, there's a bit of our decanus up there. Uh, uh, table crammed into the corner. Doesn't look crammed into the corner until, like, uh, like we did just earlier, you walk into the mirror, but we don't mind about that. Feels like you're at the prow of a ship. There again on Sukhumvit, you can see we're just straight on the Skytrain line. Mini bar fridge catering in here. Quite heavy Japanese style furniture, all very pleasant. Nicely done. Uh, and then walking through here, you think, no, you don't think, you'd be stupid to think, Ikes, I haven't got a shower. And obviously you've got a guest privy in there. And then through here, you've got much of the usual married built-in delight. Slightly more abstract art on this level, which is nice. Uh, sliding door and bathroom arrangement. More Japanese furniture, much more coordinated than the other rooms that I've seen in this hotel. Uh, extremely subtle, somehow feels more, more expensive and thought about than anything else. And the bathrooms in this hotel, they seem to be pretty much the same in the rooms that I've seen. Privy with a degree of separation from there. And a circuit, circular tub, which is obviously just a marker of ostentation because I don't think anyone uses, what, uses them. Uh, shower in the ceiling, which goes absolutely gloriously everywhere when, when you use it. But... Uh, but the room is very nice and we're very pleased with it despite the long, long wait. But the hotel was absolutely full, largely with a huge delegation when we arrived at midday today. Two de details I forgot to point out. Um, the artwork of the bed is very subtle and I'm not sure if it's going to be shown on camera. It involves the typical Thai clouds from traditional Thai art, temple paintings or the, the pattern of them, which you see quite crudely done everywhere else, but it's done in hole-punched leather, which is, uh, is very subtle and is very nice. Wardrobes, as you'd expect. This one, however, when you open the door, light comes on and you're blinded by a load of white marble delight in there for you to bash with your suitcase. And, of course, the other side is... Exactly. What do you expect your wardrobe to be? But this is uh, this is really very nice. Thank you. 